Hello, my fellow mirrors and dreamers. It is I, GoldPiplo64, and welcome back to some more Pokemon Fire Red. Last time, we met our first Pokemon, Raffi the Bulbasaur, and man, he was doing such a good job last episode, man. He was killing it out there. But also, last episode, we met Professor Oak, who sent us on our journey to, you know, just collect all the Pokemon here in the region, but I actually won't be doing because I'm not a 100%er kind of person. But yeah, we also met our butt face rival, Gary Oak. <laughs> but yeah, let, let, let's not think about him because we've got a journey of our own to complete. Anyway, today's episode, we're going to find out more about Viridian City and what goes beyond Viridian City. So yeah, without further ado, let's go. So we're going to head straight to Viridian City, and I'm going to grind while we're going there, because I mean, hey, I got to show something off, so, it, like, I got to show something off in Viridian City, so I might as well just grind so we can do that, but anyway, so yeah, um, like I've said before, um, I never actually grew up with Gen 1, and I think that's probably what's made me less attached to it, and yeah, I, I don't really really like Gen 1ers too much. Like, I think their some of their arguments are kind of, uh, like, I don't know, man. I mean, so, like, a lot of Gen 1ers like to say, oh, so most of the Pokemon designs are lazy nowadays. Like, wow, a trash Pokemon? Wow, what a trash Pokemon game. <laughs> oh, was that a floating ice cream? Wow, dude, how stupid. Oh boy, we're gonna meet some Pokemon in Gen 1 that are absolutely as dumb as they keep saying. Like, oh boy, a lot of um, Pokemon fans, you know, for example, um, for you Pokemon fans out there, Magnemite and Voltorb. Literally, Voltorb is just a ball. How do you, how do you, how can you honestly say that, like, the, like, Pokemon designs nowadays are so bad when, literally, Voltorb is just a ball? Uh, and also, what about Pidgey, huh? Pidgey's just a bird. What do you, what do you expect? Some, like, ginormous wings and, like, like, I... I'm kind of exaggerating, but you get my point, right? It's just like, not, uh, not all Pokemon designs just have to be like these cool, like interesting designs. Not all of them have to be that way because they're monsters. That's the point. They're monsters. Some of them aren't meant to be real. <laughs> like some of them like aren't meant to be animals. That's the point. <laughs> oh, God. Do people complain when Digimon don't look like real animals? No! <laughs> but we're, this isn't even Digimon! Why am I talking about this? Sorry, I uh, I just have to get on these rants, man. Because it's just like... I really don't get how people just say stuff about, like, Pokemon designs. And it's just like... Dude, come... What? Oh, oh no 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 no! That that did not happen. That did not happen. No 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 no. That <laughs> that didn't happen, right? I you, you didn't see that. <laughs> oh God! Are you kidding me? At least we got to Viridian? Not... It's not really the way I wanted to go back to Viridian, but sure. But hey, we're here in Viridian. <laughs> oh god. I couldn't lose in a cool way. Oh, okay, Raffi, you know what? We're gonna go on a training montage because you know what? We need to get you strong. We need to get you strong. We need to absolutely get them gains. Get them W's. Get all those synonyms for the word win. I, 
you get my point. So yeah, time for a training montage in the new route, Route 22. <laughs> I was waiting for that to show up, but yeah. Training montage! Hey, time to stop the montage for a little bit, but our buddy, our best, best buddy in the world, Raffi, learned a new... Oh my god, I can't believe I forgot the word attack. Uh, if you've never seen this channel before, there's going to be lots of moments like that where I just forget words. But yeah, he finally learned an actual grass type move. Because even though Leech Seed is a grass type move, it doesn't actually have power to it. It is what is called a status move, just in case if you've never heard of Pokemon. Status moves are meant to inflict, well, a status. Well, I mean, power moves, or just attacking moves in general, attack. I mean, it, it's very basic stuff, but I just want to explain that. But... I don't want to explain too much, because I mean, I know there are people here who have heard of Pokemon before, so... I just want to make sure I can please both people who have never seen Pokemon before or, you know, just um, people who've, like, seen Pokemon before. You, you get what I'm trying to say, but yeah, time to go back to the training montage. Welcome back, y'all. So, it was kind of a weird way that I stopped. So, I wanted to make sure that I would be pretty powerful. So, I got myself to level 11. Which, by the way, if you want to make sure that you're kind of caught up with the area, I'd say be around level 9, level 10. Um, I just decided to go to level 11 just for that extra kind of, like, strength. I, I guess that's what I'm trying to say. But yeah, I try to make sure that I was a little bit halfway before I go to the next level. So um, for this next um, thing that's going to happen, I can gain a bunch of levels off of it. Well, not a bunch of levels. You get my point. But yeah, so here on Route 22 is an optional thing you get to see um, if you just go up here. Thank God there wasn't a battle. But, hey, Gary. Hey, Jaden, you're off to the Pokemon League? Forget about it. You probably don't have any badges, do you? The guard won't let you through without them. By the way, did your Pokemon get any stronger? Yeah, they're strong enough to whoop your butt. That's what, mister. Alright, here we go. Our second battle of the game. Alright, here we go. Come on, Raffi. You can do this, man. You can whoop this Pidgey's butt. Oh, God. He's already using... Okay. Sand attack. It lowers accuracy, which accuracy affects whether or not your attacks can hit or not, which, if you can't tell already, that's going to be annoying. As... Case in point, I missed! And I had no control of whether or not that... Oh, no. Oh, God. <sighs> okay, you know what? I'm gonna... Tr okay, I'm gonna have to get potions. Because this is absolutely insane. <sighs> okay. I think I have to use Leech Seed right now. Okay, let's hit. Yes! Okay. Oh, it hit! Thank goodness. Leech C can get you HP back, and that's what's most important right now. And especially considering that I can't heal right now. 
Because I don't have any sir. Oh, I'm screwed. I'm so screwed. But hey, we got to level 12. That, that's good. Okay. Well, Charmander. Please don't kill me. <laughs> Oh no. Well, there's nice stone you're me. <laughs> okay, well, looks like it's time to get some potions. Yeah, I'm like great or what? Shut up, dude. You got lucky because I didn't use potions. Dang, we already taken L's and it's the second episode. But you know what? We can do better than this. We can do so much better than this. We can win, man. We we won't lose. But we can win. I'm so good at this game. <laughs> Even though that certainly didn't prove it. But you know what? It's time that we go get some potions. Because I feel like we might need some. Potions are the f man. Potions are for the weak. And you know what, man? We might have to. And hey, look at her. Look at her money, man. <laughs> we got a lot of money. Um, I think I'll just go with five. I I don't feel like I'll need more than that for this battle. Um, I think right now, I I don't plan on capturing any other Pokemon. Oh, and by the way. I already have my team figured out, so um, I know what Pokemon I'm going to catch, and I know pretty much where to find them, so I do know uh, what's going to happen. Like, I, I am fully aware of what I want, but what I want, oh god, there's going to be so many moments where I mess up my words, but anyway, yeah, I know exactly what I want from this team, so that's why I'm not catching any Pokemon at the moment, but don't worry, we will, in time, don't worry about it. All right, Gary, we're taking you down. All right, Gary, it's time to go. Round two, we're gonna take this W. I'm gonna start with the least seen, just in case. Cause I know for a fact this Pidgey is gonna be really hard to deal with. So might as well take that free damage. Oh yeah, I'd also like to say, if you do want to play the Kanto games, Bulbasaur is the best pick. And I'm not just saying that because I love Bulbasaur. No, because it's able to deal with most of the bigger fights in the game. Because literally in the first two big fights of the game, you can deal with them real easy. Not even Squirtle or Charmander can deal with them that easy. Like, man, Bulbasaur is just the best pick regardless what can i say man bulbasaur is great i usually don't like too many um grass starters but man i love bulbasaur bulbasaur is just adorable like i mean come on look at that face even though you can only see the the back but man bulbasaur is absolutely cute <sighs> but hey we're still getting that damage in so i don't have much to worry about honestly Man, if I would have leech seeded from the beginning, I think this would have been a lot easier of a fight. But, then again, I do stupid things, so I guess that's what I get. <sighs> so what? I'm still just gonna drain your health away. I hope that we can at least leech seed uh, Charmander. Because <laughs> that's probably gonna be my... That's not good. Well, actually, no, it's it's not bad because I have potions. But you know what? I want to see if I can go throughout this fight without even having to even use potions. Okay, I might have to use potions. <gasps> okay, looks like it's time for potions. I don't want to because I'm such a Pokemon master, but... I guess I have to use potions. Ew, potions. Potions are for babies. 
Wait, no! I didn't mean to click that! Okay. Okay. Come on, Leech Seed. <gasps> it worked! <laughs> I didn't expect it to work! Apparently, Leech Seed is the one that works, but not Tackle. No, not Tackle. Tackle's not gonna work. Oh, what? <laughs> T Tackle just keeps on missing, man. I, I don't get that, bro. <laughs> okay, come on. We can beat him. This isn't hard. This is... Oh, Tackle actually hit. I was so focused on talking that I didn't even realize that Raffy hit. But you know what? Raffy's a champ, man. He's able to take two Pokemon. Even though I literally used one potion. But he... Honestly, he was able to take down a Pidgey that was relatively close to his level without even having to use a potion. Like, I'm surprised. And he had the disadvantage too, which is the best part about it. Man, Raffy, props on you, man. You can do good. And just like that, we took down that stupid Charmander. This stupid Charmander. Nobody likes Charmander, except a lot of people do. <sighs> okay, all right. joke aside, I mean, uh, it's whatever. Ah, uh, you just lucked out. <laughs> yeah, right, loser. Wait, what? What's, what's going on? None, none of my red. <laughs> what? Uh. One minute thirty-seven seconds later. Oh, there we go. Oh, thank God. <laughs> I thought something bad actually happened. Ah, never mind. It was just my controller. Oh, thank God. Apparently it wasn't properly plugged in. That's weird, but okay. I heard the Pokemon League is crawling with tough trainers. I have to figure out how to get past them. You should quit dawdling and get a move on. Why don't you move on and smell me later, Dinkus? I. <laughs> okay, here's the thing, with with my other play, uh, my other let's play right now, Dingarumpa. I I would normally curse at this point, but honestly, I feel like when it comes to like I don't know Nintendo or just like Pokemon, anything like that that's like E rated and whatnot, I want to make sure that these series are like relatively E rated. So, you know, no no cursing and whatnot. And also, it kind of just helps me too. Because personally, I feel like I curse a bit too much. So, I feel like being able to, like, make sure I'm conscious of whether or not I'm using curse words or not. It, it feels honestly better. But yeah, we took down Gary like it was nothing. So, yeah. Anyways, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I hope to see you in the next episode. Bye-bye!